The Belgium Grand Prix is one of our favourite races of the season here at Motorsport Tickets. It's usually the first race back after the Formula One summer break, and at a track like Spa-Francorchamps, well, it doesn't really get much better than this. Every year, tens of thousands of motorsport nuts make the pilgrimage to the Ardennes Forest for what is undoubtedly one of the most iconic races on the calendar. And with that in mind, we've whittled down our five biggest reasons why you should be thinking of booking a ticket to the next Belgian Grand Prix at Spa. Number one, it's a legendary circuit. They simply don't make them like this anymore. The circuit at Spa Francorchamps is quite frankly breathtaking. Situated in the otherwise calm and picturesque forests of Belgium, this track holds some of motorsport's fiercest corners. Let's start with turn one at La Source. There's a short burst off the line before you reach this tight hairpin at turn one as the cars jockey for position. It's rare to see a race where there isn't carbon fibre flying around here somewhere. None less so than in 2018 when we saw Fernando Alonso's McLaren literally take to the skies and fly over the top of Shell. And if you make it through that melee, then Eau Rouge and Radion await you. These corners have excited drivers since 1925. It's an extraordinary uphill left-right flick that modern track designers simply would not have the guts to propose in the 21st century. While it's maybe not as challenging as it might have been for drivers of the past, watching modern cars take this flat out is absolutely jaw-dropping. And if a driver's brave enough to send one out the outside heading up there, then you're in for a real treat. Later around the circuit, we get to the sweeping corners of Puon, the heavy braking zone of the bus stop chicane, and it's not rare to see cars fall wide as they approach the end of the back camel straight. This circuit seriously has it all. Number two unpredictability. A challenging track like Spa will almost always lead to an unpredictable Grand Prix. The drivers have to be at the top of their game as they focus on nailing lap after lap of this treacherous circuit. And if they don't, well they can wave goodbye to that win. A good tip for anyone heading to this race is pack for the weather. Yes, you may get caught out and be in need of your poncho or an umbrella, but as all Mega F1 fans will know, that just means it's going to lead to a memorable race as the drivers try and tackle these difficult conditions. Number three, it's perfect for a road trip. Rather than hanging around in airport lobbies, why not make your journey to the Grand Prix a part of your experience? Pack up the car and set off on a road trip through Belgium and experience the country before you get to the race. Our route would start in Bruges and you can check out some of the stunning sights of the old town before you move through to Ghent and join one of the city's famous beer walks. Next up is Antwerp which has tons of waterside pop-up bars and restaurants throughout the summer where you can mull over the season so far before it restarts. Brussels is next and the capital has an electric nightlife for you to check out before your final stop Louvain, which is home to one of the world's most famous beers, Stella Artois. You can actually check out the full routes with city recommendations and what you can do while you're there on our blog. The link is on the screen right now. Number four, the atmosphere. Belgium is a race for the hardcore. Motorsport fans from across the world diverge on Spa as their heroes take on one of the world's great circuits. The town of Spa is actually pretty small, so most fans will pitch up a tent by the track and camp for the whole weekend. And if camping's not quite your scene, well, of course, glamping is an option. Pre-erected tents, Wi-Fi, bacon sandwiches in the morning, this is the stress-free way to enjoy the Grand Prix. You can check out all the accommodation options over at motorsporttickets.com. Number five, the on-track battles. Yes, we head back to the racing action for our final reason on our list, and that is because Spa has been the scene of some of driving's greatest names battle head to head. We're talking Mika Hakkinen overtaking Michael Schumacher around Ricardo Zonta on the Kemmel Straight in 2000, or Sebastian Vettel punting Jensen Button out of the race in 2010. Even as recently as 2019, when Lewis Hamilton hunted Charles Leclerc down as the young Ferrari driver from Monaco stormed to his first Grand Prix victory. There is something about this circuit that brings out the best in the world's greats. And if that's not a reason to be there, then I don't know what is. 
So that's it. They are our five reasons why you should be heading to the Belgian Grand Prix. To book your tickets, head over to the link motorsporttickets.com where you can check out all the ticket options, the best grandstands to sit in, and even some of those camping and accommodation options I touched on earlier in the video. But if you've been to the Belgian Grand Prix before, then we want to hear from you. Drop us a comment and let us know about your trip. Where did you sit and what was your view like? What action did you see? What did you get up to after the race? And more importantly, would you go again? Let us know.